tenants, they don't understand. They think they can, you know, some of them just think they can live here. I'm not going to pay my rent. That money comes out of my pocket. Maybe not right now, but down the line. If I let everybody do that, I'm out of a job because we don't have money to pay. I don't have money to pay my guys. We're done. They're not paying. They're not staying. I'm David Yelton. I'm 51 years old. And if there's a major problem or something, that's my job is to make sure it gets taken care of. My name is Mike DeLugash. I'm 42. And I've been here in Louisiana 20 years. I mean, Louisiana's got some of the most colorful people you can think of and they've all got a story. Usually the kinds of people we deal with, there are some that are professional welfare cases. Usually those don't work out very well. What's on the docket today, guys? We got four trailers to move from Western Road to Ruston, and we've got Mr. Sampson's plumbing that's backing up again. Something else we need to address? We served an eviction notice to Miss Langford over on Cypress Street a couple weeks ago. She still hasn't left yet and all of her stuff is there. Miss Langford is a handful. I mean, that battle axe has always given us a fit. I sent Trevor and Spence over there yesterday to take a look at it and just chase them off with a hatchet. Y'all might have to take care of this one yourself. I really don't want to deal with Miss Langford either, but we really got to get this resolved. Uh, yeah, I'm going to get all that done. Why? We're going to go take care of Miss Langford. Oh my gosh, what a smell. Chickens? You got chickens now? So we go into Miss Langford's. This place does not smell like Dillard's. I mean, there's chickens on the counter. This lady's gotta go. If you want me out of here, you gotta drag me out of here. No problem. Fair enough. You're out of here. Now don't fight us, Miss Langford. Come on. We don't wanna, we don't wanna hurt you. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Is this woman serious? She's chained herself to the chair. She's gonna pull a fast one on me and go crazy? I'll give her crazy. Today had a heck of a start, but overall it's been pretty productive. I think it's about time to wrap it up. All right, it's four o'clock, Mike. I'm headed out here. Lake Darwin's called my name. Come go with us. No, I can't. I gotta do these permits, and I got those leases to drop Dude, off, and uh, I guess I'm gonna have to do Samson's plumbing. Call Spence, let him go, take care of the plumbing. Actually, Spence called him sick today, again. You kidding me? That's twice this week. Come on, Mike, go with me. You know what? You're right. get away to the I haven't been fishing in a long time. It sounds, sounds good. Yeah. Ah, you're talking. We're out of here, dude. I'm glad David asked me to go fishing. I've really been needing to go and get my mind off of things. Let's go, dude. Come so on. We pull up to the lake, and lo and behold, who's there? Lake's waiting. Wait, 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 Look who's here. Old Spencer, and he's fishing. Spencer's not so sick after all. Oh, he will be. I guess we got a diagnosis on his condition. Wait, 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 I what? got, an, I got an idea. Hold on. I know exactly how we're going to handle this situation. Let's see if he's got his phone on him. Oh, gosh. Hello? Hey, Spencer, how you doing, man? Hey, Mike. Uh, I'm not doing too good, brother. I feel pretty rough, as a matter of fact. Well, you think you're going to be back in tomorrow? You know, Spence thought he could pull a fast one on his bosses. You know, there's really only one thing left to do. Man, look, it's been like this the past two or three days. It's like everything I eat. Turned right around and came right back out. Well, I hope you get to feeling better. Now, here's the deal. The doctor said that it could be. It's just a 24-hour deal. And I'll be back tomorrow feeling good again. You know, we'll just have to see, though. Would you and David, would you boys, uh, would y'all pray for me? Yeah, I've got your prayer. Oh. 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 Hey, boys. <laughs> oh. I guess the Lord works in mysterious ways, huh? 